I don't know if you have the demand to remove the watermark in a video when editing it. And removing the watermark is never as hard as you think it is if you master the ways. In this video, we will introduce four ways to remove the watermark in video. So if you're interested in this topic, keep watching. First thing first, free download the video pro vlogger through the link we put in the description box down below. Then launch your software. Create a new project. Import the footage. Drag it into the video track. We can see in the preview window a watermark on the bottom right of the image. Find a crop icon in the toolbar. Click on it. Here we can have two ways to crop out the watermark. The first one is to click on the 16 to 9 aspect ratio. Adjust the mouse to select the frame that doesn't have the watermark. Click apply. And now you can see that the watermark is gone. In addition, we have another method. Still in the crop editor. We drag the top bottom edges to create a movie-like strip mask for it. And then, click Apply to achieve the desired result. Using this method, all you need to do is to import a logo image of your choice. Drag it into the overlay track. Resize and reposition it in the preview window until it covers the original watermark. Then, adjust the duration to align the length of the video. Preview it. Isn't the effect also very good? If you don't have your own logo, you can try the third method. First, find a text icon in the toolbar. Click on it. Enter the text content and choose a font in the inspector on the top right. If you think the black background is too dull, you can click here. Find the background section, scroll down and select custom. Pick a color you like here. Then apply the adjustment and return to the interface. You can see the background color has changed. Then, find the camera logo at the top of the preview window. Click it to generate a picture. Then, import the image into the software. Delay the text effect on the subtitle track. Then, drag the text image into the overlay track. Align it with the length of the main video. Click on Crop again to crop it to the right size. Click Apply and return to the main screen. Now we just need to click Show or Hide Layer Rectangle to move the position to cover the original watermark. With this method, you can also remove the watermark easily. Let's take a look at the video. We can see that the watermarked part of the image is similar to the image content above. Thus, we can try copying the similar pixels to remove the watermark. First, right click and select the copy or use the shortcut Ctrl C to copy the original video. Then, select the overlay track, right click and select the paste. Then click on Crop. Here we crop other parts on the image that comes with the similar pixels as a watermark. Click Apply to return to the main interface. Then click Show or Hide Layer Rectangle to adjust the size and the position to cover the original watermark. 
we can see that the watermark is covered up. And to blend in better with the original video, now we go to the inspector. Scroll down and find the compositing. Add a dark blend mode to it. Take a look at the preview. You can see the watermark is still faintly discernible, but that's okay. Drag the mouse up. In the color and filter area to adjust the exposure and contrast. And then look at the result. And you can see the image turns out more lateral. Alright, that's all for today's video. Anyway, don't forget to click the subscribe button to subscribe our channel if you haven't yet. And we will see you soon in our next video. Hope you enjoy. Bye-bye.